What's going on guys, FM Wizard here and today I'm bringing you a tutorial on how to add player faces into your football manager game. You know how most of the players in the game have this sort of silhouette of a player, no faces, a bar a few in the leagues that have licenses, for example like the championship has licenses so they got faces, so you go on the championships, basically all the teams that have a logo already without you adding anything, most of their players will most likely have a face. But today I'm going to show you how to add hundreds of thousands of more players faces into the game and it's quite simple. So first off you're going to need WinRAR. I'll leave the download page link in the description so just download and install whatever version applies to you and then once you've done that we're going to move on to our pack. I'll also leave this link in the description so you just want to download whatever way you want so you use a torrent or via the web it's a massive download. It's four small parts with a total of 11.8 gigabytes, but it adds hundreds and hundreds of thousands of players' face to the game. So that's why it's just lots of images. Um, so maybe do it overnight, but yeah, just download that and then we'll move on to our next step. All right, so now that WinRAR is installed and we have our mega pack here, now we're going to find our directory. Now I'm going to put the direct the, your football manager default directory in the description. So just have a look in the description, and then just copy it out. Open up a file explorer and paste it in the bar. Now you just want to get rid of the asterisk and the your user, and just literally put whatever your user is. All right, and then that's your football manager directory. And now that we're here, you're going to right click, go new folder, and call it graphics alright so now go on this newly made graphics folder you might already have it but if not make one and create one called face packs alright just like that now you wanna uh, click on this and then right click and go extract files click OK mine will be very, uh, very quick because I've just I've already got it so I've just sort of chucked some of the images out and chucked it in one of these just so I don't have to download this massive 12 gig file again but it's essentially the same thing it'll just take longer and then you want to take it and put it in this newly made face packs folder just like that all right i don't know what day this will this will have a different date to you probably depending on when you download it so yeah that's that and now we're going to move into our game all right now that we're back in our game we want to click on preferences click on this advanced tab here and then go over to this top right most common and go down to interface. Now we want to go down to the subtitle of skin and we want to unclick this top box use caching to decrease page loading times and click reload skin and click confirm. Now it should take some time as it reads your skins. Alright now we load into our game. Alright, so we're back in the save game now, so let's see if it works. Let's click on uh, Pedro. Yep, so there we go, face back. So that's when you know it's successfully installed. Um, we have a look at a couple other players. There we go. Um, so yeah, that's how you install it. I'm just going to do one quick thing. If you have preferences, I don't know if it does anything, but I always switch these back. It won't, the face max will still be there. So it's just... You use caching, uh, caching to decrease page loading times. Just tick that back again so you don't get the long loading times. I don't know if it actually improves it. But if you load back in, you should see they're still there. And yeah. Let's have a look. Yeah. So I don't know if it does anything, but I just do it anyway. So thanks for watching, guys. Um, if I helped you out, leave a like and subscribe for more FM content. Thank you very much.